Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a recreation of David Bowie's Ziggy Stardust makeup look and I have him right there so if I keep looking straight, like well for me this is straight, if I keep looking that way it's because I'm looking at a picture of him to make sure that I get everything right. Okay, so here I'm going in with Tarte Shape Tape in tan as my foundation, and then I'm just gonna buff it out with my Real, Techni Real Techniques Beauty Sponge. And I'm just taking it down my neck here. And now I'm going in with my Maybelline Fit Me in the shade 20 Sand. And just using that to highlight my face. Okay, and so next I'm going in with my Maybelline Fit Me Powder in the shade 25 and my Kat Von D loose powder setting brush, something like that. It's the number 20 brush. Okay, and now I'm going to go into my Kat Von D shade and light contour palette, and I'm going to go mainly into this shade and maybe a little bit of those. Oh, and I'm taking my Kat Von D shade and light brush. And then I'm just gonna lightly go down the sides of my nose, just with any excess product. And then I'm gonna go in with the light side and go in with the lightest shade. Before I go any further, I'm going to take my concealer, take a spoolie, and just kind of coat the spoolie. And then I'm going to go over my eyebrows with that. And now I'm going in with the Kat Von D Lolita blush. I'm just now realizing how much Kat Von D I'm using, and no, I'm not sponsored. I really wish I was, though. And I'm just going in with this powder brush from Vanity Planet, and I'm gonna go over all of the places that we contoured. I'm gonna go on to the eyes and he's got oh I'm going into the Cat Von D shade and light palette. I mean Satan Center palette. And it looks like he's only got shimmers in his on his lid and crease. So I'm gonna go into this 
random Morphe brush and Stigmata, the red shade. And I'm gonna just have that in the crease. Okay, now I'm going in with Sacred Heart and I'm just gonna tape that on my finger and put that all over the lid. And now I'm going into the shade Devil, the orange shade. And I'm just gonna put that all over. Go into Becca's dreamsicle highlighter my finger and tap that on the center very vertically and kind of blend the edges I forgot to bring some of that shadow to the lash now I'm just gonna add some mascara stripes. I'm nervous for this part. Right there. Morphe flat shader brush. Okay, so here I'm just just going in with that shadow and hoping for the best. Roughly drawing the shape that David Bowie has, but onto my face, we have very different face shapes, so it's obviously not going to look exactly the same, but here I'm trying my best. <laughs> so, we'll continue to see me just try to get the right shape. Okay, so I'm just about to get started on the forehead and I completely skipped showing me filling it in because I thought that was pretty boring and it took me quite a while uh, to really get the pigment as strong as I could. I went in with my finger for the majority of the space and then closer to the edges of lines I use my brush. Now I'm going to go in with this little lip brush from Morphe and this shade and I'm going to do the blue stripes.
Okay, so now I'm going in with the Kat Von D tattoo liner to do the black stripes. Seriously, Kat Von D, please sponsor me. <laughs> I love your products. She crisp. She crisp. Yes. Okay, and I'm just about to mess it up a little bit right there there and underneath the eye don't do what I did don't go right up to your eye in the picture he doesn't have it right up next to his eye it stops where the orange meets the blue so I suggest you do that and now I'm going in with NARS Rikujian satin lip pencil Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and obviously this isn't the finished product. <laughs> it's obviously nowhere near as bright as his. I think if I were to do this again, I'd go in with some cream paints or lipsticks. That way it's super bright like the black is. Um, Hope you guys liked the video and feel free to leave suggestions in the comments below see you next time and feel free to check out my instagram at jordan marie van ruin it's also in the description bar